viewers welcome to this video in this video question is the difference between the compound interest for a year payable half yearly and the simple interest on the same sum lent out at 10% per annum for a year is rupees 15 find the sum of money lent out so this is the question so solve this so first you will find out the value of the simple interest so first you add si will be equals to the formula for si is p into i into t by 100 so put down the value so principal is unknown so principal is p into rate it is given 10 percent per half year so 10 percent per half year means you have to divide it by 2 so if 10 divided by 2 that is 5 percent so in this question our rate of interest will be 5 percent 5 into time is given one year so therefore if we convert it in time into times of six months so it will become two six months so it becomes p into 2 by 100 so you cut 2 and 150 1 10 so it becomes p by 10 so now we find out the formula for the compound interest so therefore ci is equal to the right principal into 1 plus r by 100 to the power n minus the principal is equal to the formula for ci so now you put down the values principal unknown into 1 plus rate is our 5 percent by 100 times 2 minus so here we take this principle as the common so it will become minus 1 here so 5 and 10 we cut it becomes 1 by 20 principle into now we take 20 as the LCM so 20 into 120 plus 1 to the power 2 minus 1 so it becomes principle into 21 by 20 square minus 1 so now I have to minus uh, this with minus 1. So principal into. So for this first we have to find out the square. So 21 square we find out. 21 into 21 that is 1, 2. It becomes 441. So 21 square is 441. So it becomes 441 by 20 square. It is 400 minus 1. So now I find out. Principal into to take 400 as the LCM. 441 minus this 400 it becomes equal to principal into 41 by 400 so this will be the value of our compound interest so now we write that therefore the ci minus si that is given the question it is rupees 15 so therefore now you can put down the values ci is p into 41 by 400 minus the si that is p by 10 is equal to 15 so now here also you take this p as the common so this p will become minus 1 so p into 41 by 400 minus 1 by 10 is equal to 15 so now you the minus here p into take 400 41 and this will become minus 40 is equal to 15 so now principal into 1 by 400 is equal to 15 so now finally this 400 will go for multiplication here p into sorry p is equal to 15 into 400 that is equal to rupees 6000 so therefore our principle for this question will be 6000 so this is our final answer for this question so guys thanks for watching this video and please subscribe my channel for more solutions